Well, well um, hello, my name is Carlos, and uh, I would like to show you because yesterday we were trying to uh, broadcast, we were trying to make a Facebook Live uh, alternating between camera and also slides. And it was really hard to find, actually, what we had to do was make something like this. We were just uh, recording the first video right there, and then we just jump to the second video and the second video we were sharing everything on the, the slides that we had prepared and then after that we had to just uh, go back again and record again in the camera and then combine the three videos that was crazy but uh, now i found a simple solution that i hope is going to be helping you guys uh, to record to basically create your Facebook lives alternating between the camera and also the slides and how I make it this is going to be the presentation that I would like to show, show you so basically if we are uh, going I record I create this um, presentation on the um, Google Drive and that's one of the tabs that I have in my Google Chrome so basically I open the tabs that I need one is the Facebook the other is going to be the camera and the other is going to be this um, is light. So then it's going to be a matter of alternating between tabs and basically what's happening is that all the tabs will be over here on top. So I'm going to be creating or the, the basically sharing the Chrome tabs and I am using one site that I found is called turncameraon.com. So let me show you how to do it. So basically you are going to be just going to your Facebook live and then click the button that says live, right? So and then um, the camera is going to be accessing, which is this one by default, and you will have the option to share the screen right here. When you click on share the screen, it's going to be presenting you three options. They share your entire screen, uh, application window, if you have some applications in your Chromebook, or the Chrome tab, which is basically which of the tabs you would like to share. In order for this to work, what you need to do is select the, your entire screen. You just click on, on the screen that is uh, presenting. You will have then the option to share and then you go live, basically. That's it. You're going to be starting then with that. Then you're going to be going to uh, this uh, site that I have over here, which is called turncameraon.com, which is going to be activating your camera. It's going to be looking something like this. When it activates the camera, you will see yourself right there. But there is a button that says full screen over here in the corner. When you click on full screen, you can adjust the camera basically just in order to hide all the letters that you don't want. And you know very well that if you go to Chrome, uh, there is an option over here to basically hide the tabs if you select over here the full screen or just keeping the tabs all the time. I prefer to just hide in them. And so that's why it's going to be looking much, much better. Then once you have that, basically, it's going to be a matter of just alternating between the presentations that you have. And uh, of course, with a little practice, you're going to be just going back and forth and presenting all the slides. That's how you're going to be, um, be able to present and uh, do the Facebook Lives, alternating between the camera and the tabs and the slides or whatever you have over there presented. I really hope that this solution can be helping you. Um, uh, I was researching a little bit on YouTube. I couldn't find anything on, on this. Uh, I think it's very simple, but I think it's working. So hopefully for your next presentation, it's going to be helping you guys. And I hope this helps. OK, I'm here just to help you. That's a suggestion. Hopefully everything will be OK. Now with the tabs, I'm going to be just ending my Facebook uh, live video. Take care. OK, bye, guys.